like a birthday, the silver, the gold, the blue. You can use these for any occasion. So check them out on hsn.com. I'll tell you, every year these are so incredibly popular and they fly out the door. And they're from uh, us here at HSN at $19.95, three flex pay. The item number is 797-874. All right, I'm gonna continue shopping with you. Uh, with our with our next show, let me pop this over here. Uh, joining me on the couch, I feel like I'm my own talk show. Uh, it's I Rebecca know. Wood. You look beautiful. You I love look your gorgeous. hair. Thank you so much. <laughs> and your vacation looked amazing. It, it was pretty fun. Today's my first day back vacationing, but. Uh, <laughs> I'm glad I'm easing into it oh with holiday, gosh. right? Oh my gosh, come to this, it's <laughs> come like, to this, come right it's to pretty celebrate. magical. Exactly. All right, so here's what's coming up. This next entire hour is really, really special. It's the only hour on the day. We have Thomas Kincaid making your Christmas magical. And I wanted to give you like a preview of one of my favorite items from the show. This is an LED lantern with a six hour timer. It is on sale for $28.95. Um, you are getting this incredible Thomas Kincaid set. So you're getting all three of them, right? All three, <laughs> all three that are nine and a half inches tall, so they're substantial. The, yeah, and I will say that when you know when I I knew I was coming in, I knew I had holiday, and when I saw that I had the only hour of Thomas Kincaid today, I know how sentimental and important Thomas Kincaid is. I remember this was years ago here at HSN. We had a tapestry that was Thomas Kincaid that kind of lit up and I bought it. Every year I take it out and hang it up. And we haven't had Thomas Kincaid items here for years and years and years and years. This is, I can't even remember the last time. I, I, do you know what year we it was? Chris, no, for years, I don't know how many years it's been, but yeah, it's Christmas been a long in July time. was the first time in a long time. A long time this year, 2023, uh, we've got these items back, but we're gonna jump in and talk about um, everything that we have in the show, but I wanted to show you the lanterns because they were some of my favorite. And They're so beautiful, yeah. all of them are. And what you're gonna yes. see is we have a trio of Thomas Kincaid paintings on all of the decor that we're mm -hmm. about to bring you. And they're three of his most popular Christmas prints. They are beautiful. You've got... Um, the Christmas Chapel. The Christmas Chapel. The Christmas Light Express. That's or Santa's one. Workshop. Or Santa's Workshop. Yeah. And we'll show you in detail more. Uh, but what I love is in each of these items that you're seeing, you can pick your favorite your favorite picture and bring it home in various different ways. Um, now let me talk, start if I can, with the chapel. Oh my gosh. There's a little sentimental. You were talking, yeah, it comes I'm apart. Like, I'm like seeing this Look for the, this. by the way, just so you know, I'm seeing this for the first time as I come out. So you've got the base of it. Which, which is you acrylic. Could put, yeah, which you could put other things in, but you're getting the Thomas Kincaid flameless candle. And this candle is, I mean, I'm gonna let Rebecca do all yep. this, but I'm seeing you. It's that's a flameless candle, your job. six inch pillar. <laughs> yeah. And then you can see this as well as glass. Um, but it's a sturdy glass. It's oh not like gosh. something that would shatter. <gasps> but look at, see, so you know Thomas Kincaid was the painter of light, right? So in each of these, we've been able to capture his light so beautifully. Of course, here it is in this candle. But it does come with this stunning base. And each base is taking a scene from the actual picture. So this is going to be the Christmas Chapel 1. And he actually, Thomas Kincaid, pictured and had planned um, three different Christmas chapels. But he was only able to finish Christmas Chapel 1. So this is a very oh. beautiful kind of, it's one of his last pieces. One of the things that I love about it is you can see um, there is actually a horse-drawn carriage. And there's a gentleman in green. And they said that's Thomas Kincaid because he was known all winter long to wear a green jacket. Um, but as you move I've already learned two things about Thomas Kincaid that I did not oh, know. Oh, you're going to learn so much. I'm he was excited. just a magical person, but Christmas was his jam. Yeah. <laughs> Christmas was his jam, okay. He, I loved yeah. Christmas, and he loved the nostalgia of it. If he loved three things, it was traditions, family, and nostalgia. That's what he loved, mm -hmm. and he would bring them all into each of his paintings. And how we were able to do this with the base to actually take part of his painting and bring it to life with that acrylic setting and then put a beautiful six inch flameless candle that has a timer on there. I love that too. Mm -hmm. Timers are very important, I think. Yeah. First of all, it, it saves on the battery life, but also you can set it so when you walk into your home, it's just a glow with candlelight. There's nothing better. Um, so you're seeing me hold the Christmas chapel and there is the horse-drawn carriage on the acrylic base. Then as we go to Christmas Light Express, 
this is going to, he always worked with, with Lionel Trains. Do you remember Lionel Trains? I do. Yes. I, of course I do. Massive Lionel Trains. Lionel Trains actually requested that they use this particular train set in his painting. Um, and he did. But one of the things that he did so well here, you have that beautiful train. So as you said, you could put these apart because this entire candle is decorated. When you put it into the base, I actually think for this one, you would love to have them side by side. You do have that candle as the base, and then you have Santa flying. It's so beautiful in the High Sierra Mountains. He really wanted the High Sierra Mountains because that was his home, and that's where he just he just really believed that it captured um, winter best with the uh, heavy trees, with um, fallen right. snow. Now, if you were to take a look at Santa's workshop two days before, He's checking his list twice. You can see him right there. He does it. And we've got the beautiful um, winter. We've got the, the glow of the fireplace and then the contrast of the cold outside in the, wind, in the North Pole. But then we've got Santa here on that acrylic base. So the acrylic base is gorgeous. Just like that, I want to show you all sides. But the candle is, a, so it's kind of a two-in-one. It is, it is. And you're getting, again, $24.95. This is brand new. The entire hour is Thomas Kincaid, uh, you know, pieces, paintings on different mediums that we're going to be showing throughout the hour. And I know that uh, you're a fan, and I'm a fan, everybody, it's so Americana, the, the Thomas Kincaid, the painter of light, where the way the light plays on it, and adding that flameless candle where you don't have to worry about, oh, did I, did I blow out the candle? Is it going to, you know, it, it's the safety no, of yes. flameless candles have made them so incredibly popular. But these, these are really spectacular. They're also really fun. I think there's a whimsy about them, especially the base Rebecca, that yes, have like, you know, that childlike excitement for Christmas. 100%. I think you have the beauty and the classicness of the Thomas Kincaid painting on the actual candy candle. And then on the base, you've got that fun whimsy that he was able to capture, the yeah. moments that really make um, Christmas and the holiday special. Uh, what I do love is it's a deep set candle too. So that flameless candle dances inside. So when this is set apart, it really looks like that flame is dancing and swaying and flickering inside. There is a, right? Right here on the bottom, there is going to be a six hour timer, on off six hour timer. It takes um, three double, uh, triple A batteries that you just pop in right there. And I love that you do have that timer, but you just decide, do you want the Christmas Chapel, mm -hmm. Christmas Light Express, or Santa's Workshop? Yeah, and the um, batteries, again, three AAA batteries, Rebecca mentioned that uh, you just pop in there, you're good to go. And this is, I think, a wonderful gift. I think this would be a great hostess gift. You're coming over to somebody's house for holiday, for dinner, or if you want to get a couple of them for your tablescape, you could have them on your mantle. Uh, I know you probably, those of you who are fans of Thomas Kincaid already probably own a few things. We've got some amazing ornaments coming up. Oh, they're beautiful. They're, they're, they're beautiful. I love the ornaments. Uh, um, the chapel is the number one seller, by the way, and we only started out with 500 of these. We didn't have 20,000. Sometimes we do have 20,000 of things. You know what it is? Yeah. So I think it each. was around the millennium when it switched. I think they said something like 82% of homes in America had a Thomas Kincaid painting in their home. Yeah, so I know I do. I know, and <laughs> my, I grew up with it. My yeah. mom would take all of them out. She had his plates everywhere. Yeah. She had different paintings. But yeah. what I've noticed is when I come out here and I'm kind of working and setting things up and, and looking at things, people will come to me and say, Oh my gosh, my grandmother had that. My mother had it. It is yeah. one of those generational things that bring back memories. I think if Thomas Kincaid could know that he really created his own nostalgia. Yeah, exactly. He would just be moved. He <laughs> really would. Yeah. I they're, they're beautiful. We've got an entire hour. We've got more goodies, more items coming up. Again, this whole hour is about Thomas Kincaid. And if you're like, oh, I want to get as much as I can, let me give you a $20 coupon. If you do not have an HSN card, you can open one today and get $20 off uh, your entire purchase. Go to hsn.com and put in HSN card in the search. Or if you would like, you can call the 800 number, 695-1418. All right, well, we've got so many beautiful items that we're going to get to in this hour. We're going to move on and talk about our next item, which is 
tabletop nightlight. These have a beautiful wooden base, and again, I've never seen anything like this before. The item number is 844-008. We're getting them plugged in and set up so you can see them. Three flex pay of $8.32. We have three different scenes to choose from. Each are these beautiful glass that you're looking at the picture in that wood base, and then you also are choosing between the Christmas Chapel, the Christmas Light Express, and Santa's workshop. Shop. But Rebecca, I've, I've honestly, I've never seen these for Thomas Kincaid or any other brand or any other style. Isn't They're incredible, just beautiful. It looks like the painting of Thomas Kincaid has come to life. Come to life. And what a beautiful way to display his painting, right? Instead of having it on a the wall. Agreed. It's such I a beautiful I know we're calling way. this a nightlight, but to me it looks like a piece of art that is shown in its best light. Ex love that. And it really captures the painter of light. Yeah. <laughs> in light. Yeah. It's such a beautiful, beautiful way. We've got the wood base here, as you can see. And then this is going to be acrylic. It all lights up. It is those three most popular mm -hmm. um, prints that you get to decide again again. This is going to be Santa's workshop. And here's what I want to show you as I do that. It's beautiful both ways. Yeah. So this is not something you have to set up and worry, like, mm -hmm. what is it going to look like on the back? You're capturing that both ways. Look at that. Oh, uh, my gosh. And by the way, these are acrylic, so you don't have to worry about, oh, is that going to cat, the cat's going to knock it over, my grandchild's going to grab it, it's going to break. It's, they're acrylic, so don't worry about no, that. No, you don't have to. I love that you don't have to worry yeah. about that. I've got some rambunctious pups and a 10-year-old, <laughs> and you don't have to worry. One of the things that you can do with this, that even when you're looking at his true painting, the very, the, the truest form of his painting, uh, it's gorgeous and stunning, and it's almost hard to capture and look at everything because it isn't lit up because this is lit up you see the elves at work you see the little reindeer here in the back you see the christmas cookies that mrs claus just took out of the oven you see him checking his list for the second time of course and the beautiful fire and with that light it brings it all to life so santa's workshop on this absolutely stunning and then as we move down to the christmas light express this really shows um, this painting in its truest form because in the painting actually um, in this particular train set that lionel train set that they wanted mm -hmm. to use it is outlined in light oh, so you could uh, beautiful. Again, in it the looks painting, magical it really it does. does and you see all the the movement you've got the movement of the actual swoops of the beautiful uh, smoke but Santa's creating his own speed there. Mm -hmm. And when you look at it, you can actually see the reindeer are looking at yeah, you almost at like that. you caught right us. There. <laughs> like they're just kind of like flying through the air and leaving like a little trail of smoke like an airplane would. Uh, and it, again, $24.95. If you've got your grandchild coming to stay with you and they always oh. want a nightlight for the holidays, just imagine if this is the nightlight and how excited, you know, just, but there's also something like really warm, like the chapel. It's just like very warm and comforting and it's just beautiful. So when we talk about him painting light a lot of times I think we think of candlelight um, the light bulbs but what I thought was so pretty here is you've got the coldness of winter the light mm -hmm. the coldness of lint and it's all being reflective onto the little pools of melted snow uh, and look at how this night light is able to capture that on the side over here but then the light on the Christmas tree is a different kind of it brings up the actual true colors a lot of times if you're thinking something's going to be lit like this it's going to be one color this actually brings the painting to life. Right, and when you're looking at the, the tree here, that of, uh, you know, the holiday tree, you see the light going through makes all the different colors of the tree, like the green lights, the red lights, the gold star at the very top of the tree. You're, that's a really great point because it's multicolor even though there's one light, but it's illuminating the light of the paint. Of the the paint literally looks like it's glowing. It's, it's almost like it brought what he was envisioning in his head to life. To life, yeah. Exactly. I, um, one of the things that I love about this, this little story behind the chapel, is he said one of his favorite things were Christmas Eve services. Mm -hmm. And do you remember when you, would, I don't know if you ever did that, when you have the candle and you'd light it from your neighbor and then you take the candle and then you light it. You know, it. the Jewish people did not do that. You did. Well, you had, you <laughs> had candles though. You had candles Different and eight candles. nights. You had eight nights of candles. I'm just real with America. It's yeah. true though. Yeah. So what we would do <laughs> Not is, in the chapel. Not in my, the chapel, no. Not in the synagogue. Not in the... <laughs> You had candles, though. <laughs> yeah. But we would we would light it, and then yeah. the whole right. chapel Beautiful. would be a glow. And yeah. that's what he was able to do. But you can't really actually see mm -hmm. the parishioners. 
but you picture them. Does that make sense? It does. And no matter, speaking of faith, no matter what your faith is, <laughs> look, you're giving me the look. <laughs> no matter what your faith is, the trains, the Santa, I mean, it's, we did, you know, traditions. Santa, the traditions, the Santa, the trains, with all that. Yes. I get my, my daughter had her picture taken with Santa at the yes. mall every year. I mean, my it's kids like are half part Jewish. Of, yeah. So they got, they got Christmas and Hanukkah. They got right. so many gifts. It was not funny. So we do have yeah. the same traditions of family, right? right. Really Absolutely. at the base of this, it's yeah. family. It's bringing your loved ones together. It's celebrating a time to um, just slow down, really <laughs> slow down and enjoy the nostalgia and memories. And this is what these are able to do um, beautifully, beautifully. Right. And let me give you the dimensions. So six inches in the length, um, seven and a quarter in the height. And the depth is one and uh, seven, seven, like one and three quarters. So it's, it's, a, a really substantial size. It's not like a little teeny, oh, it's so tiny, I can't see the painting, but it's not so overwhelming. You couldn't have it on a nightstand. It no, really is like really. a perfect size for a nightstand. So I could see you getting a couple, maybe if like you can't decide between two of them, get a couple of them. And have all three yeah. of his paintings and, if and you wanted to. And they're called for nightstands, but I could see like maybe, you know, having one on the kitchen, if you have a kitchen island in the night, you have like when you have guests come yes. over and they come in the kitchen to get like a glass of water in the middle of the night, what, you've got like a little bit of, a illuminating where the corners of the island are and so you navigate somebody's house. It's or, really beautiful. Can you imagine having these on the mantle and having the stocking holders right below it? And yes. so each stocking oh, has a, a different idea. one. I think that would be really I great. I love that idea. And speaking of stockings, I, I asked, so I get the pleasure of talking to the studios and finding out those little tidbits, the little secrets that are tucked into each of these um, pieces of work. And there are five different stockings on this. I'm like, oh, who are there's for? And they're like, we don't know. <laughs> So they can be they for, for whoever you think they should be for. But I, I would love more like insight onto Thomas Kincaid, the person, his life. He, where is he from? I mean, do you he was from the High Sierras. Um, he one of his favorite things was just the holidays. His mom, he was raised. He was kind of a latchkey kid. He said so. Oh. He really, he really um, hung Crave on. Crave that nostalgia. Crave the yeah. nostalgia and yeah. love those moments. Do you know, I also my mom and dad both worked, so I was a latchkey kid too. See. And I, I do love. I, I decorate for the holidays like a lot of life and everything I do try to over go above, go and, beyond. above and beyond yeah, because yeah, absolutely I, I really do see that because you kind of crave that kind of like home home setting up so $24.95 for each of these 844-008 uh, I did not expect you to say that about Thomas Kincaid yes. yeah. I, love, I, see, I love all the history and the details three flex pay of eight dollars and 32 cents uh, are we gonna continue on right away or or take a little okay because coming up in about 10 minutes, these canvases. So this is what I have in my, in my home and we had them here and I'm talking years and years and years ago. But this this canvas that is illuminated, you, you have like a little battery pack and you put the, the batteries in it and it gets tucked away with like a hook and loop closure, you don't see them. They look like paintings that illuminate but the paintings are made of canvas. And I do, ha I have one and I take it out every year. That's what my mom had. Yep. Really, yeah. And these scenes are, are more like, you know, snowy holiday scenes. At Black Friday deal price of just $34.95, you've got three flex pay of $11.65. The shipping and handling is $5.50. You've got three different choices with the canvas. Uh, the choices for the canvas are the- Same pictures. The, yeah, oh, okay, the night yep. before Christmas, Sunday evening sleigh ride, or a Christmas wish, or all aboard for Christmas. So there there you go. Actually, it's going to be the three that you're seeing throughout the entire one. Oh. That's what we had for Christmas in July. Um, I know, I see it, but I just wanted you to, yeah, it's going to be the same three. Thank you three. for saving me. No, no, that's okay. I'm sorry, my card is wrong. You're not wrong. You, we you, just so had tell it a few months ago. Have, oh, I don't, this card is from a few months ago. They must have snuck it into my, okay, what, what are the choices? So the, it's going to be the same pictures that okay. we're seeing, the same okay. painting. So it's going to be Santa's workshop. Thank it you. is going to be a Christmas chapel, and it's mm -hmm. going to be um, I, Christmas. I get the feeling like I was express. not the first host to, <laughs> to make that mistake. To see that. Okay. So this, the repeating, that's what you're going to see throughout are these oh, okay. three most popular of his um, Christmas paintings that are being brought throughout and, these different And Rebecca, items. do you get all three with this? Yes, all you three. You get all three? All three of them. Okay, so here you have a set of three LED ornaments, and they illuminate from inside, they illuminate, right? and the batteries oh. are already installed. Already installed, They're okay. They're all ready to go to turn them on and off. You just, you're gonna turn this top seat. That's off, you can hardly see it. Look how beautiful it is off and on. So that's off, 
and that's on. Oh, it illuminates. I see. Look at so that. So this is something that so many times when you have something with light, it's not as pretty when it's not on. Okay. This is absolutely just a stunning oh. on and off, and they're indestructible. They're not oh. going to break, as you can see. Even even a host can't break even them. Even a wow, host that's pretty... like Helen cannot <laughs> break <old>. them. <laughs> but you can see Day. you're getting all three. <laughs> yeah. You've got the beautiful navy um, blue background for the Christmas chapel with the... Um, kind of a goldish, so it's like a tarnished gold mm -hmm. snowflake. Yeah. And then we've got that kind of jewelry box turquoise back. I love how round they are. You know, yeah. so many times we, we have, we've seen these in the past and I think we'll see some coming up where they're flat. I love how these look like a true ornament. Yeah. And that's gonna be a silver snowflake. And on this side, we're going to see Christmas Light Express. That's going to be, I love that. That Santa just makes me happy. I feel like he's swooping in with my gift as we speak. And you're getting all three. All three. All three. So if you get like the night light, if you get like the lanterns, like things that it's all, it's all gonna work back it's with each other. It all works back together. They yeah. all play beautifully together. And then the third in the, uh, triplet set that you're getting is going to be Santa's workshop. And that's gonna be a gold background just to give you a look with the gold snowflakes. They're stunning. I love that it already is gonna come. When it comes to you, it's it's ready to be displayed. Whether it's gonna be on your tree, if you wanted to get a little stand like this, it is beautiful in and of itself. You like know, this. when I think about these, cause these are substantially large, you certainly can put them on the Christmas tree, mm -hmm. but I feel like you could also like have, a, have them on a stand like this and put them on other places because they're really like pieces of art that kind of stand alone. You know what's so pretty about these two is if you are having, um, because they, you don't need these plugged in or anything. So if you're having a dinner, can you imagine having these as little gifts on each of the tables? Oh, That'd how be like, beautiful. Wouldn't that be? Le like on your each little, next on to each table. little place yeah, settings. in place settings. Yeah. And then they get to take this with them and then they will have that. So this is something for that. When you're looking at that price point, when you're getting three, just one of these is a great teacher's gift. Um, you know, you think of all the people you have to gift. I think it's less than ten dollars. Oh, oh yeah. And it is substantial in and of itself. You don't need, you know, you would take a look at that, but look how large that is. Right. Or it's, like a little white elephant gift, like at the oh, holidays. Yeah. That would but, be perfect. But again, you're getting three of these, so you can certainly, you know, if you're if you're like, you know, I love Thomas Kincaid, I want to do it on my tree, I would buy two sets of these. You get six of them. They're so big, you could sort of put them, you know, space them throughout your tree and then do other ornaments, and you really have like a whole Thomas Kincaid tree. Uh, it's oh, really Right, be uh, because this these are these are big and substantial. They're almost uh, four inches in their circumference. In their good, good word. Thank I'm you. Very proud of that. <laughs> <laughs> you can tell Rebecca and I are friends of her life. And she's proud of me I'm when so I use a big word. I'm so proud to use a big word like that. It's so great. You know, it is a surprise. Surprise myself with that word. <laughs> it yeah. came right out. It's a five, five dollar word. <laughs> <laughs> but it is. It's a large in cir circumference. You can see, and then it does already come with that beautiful ribbon on top. So if you do want to hang it just like that. The batteries come installed to turn it on and off. You just turn this top off and on. That's all you have to do. But even if they were to twist and turn, look how beautiful they are from every angle. Just because the artwork is right here, that's where the light is. It is beautiful even from the back. Mm. So beautiful. And you're getting all three, by the way, for yes. $27.95. I just want to point out you're getting all three. So if you're like, I want my whole tree like this, you get a couple sets, you have six of them, you're, you're going to be good to go. And they look beautiful. They come with the batteries. They're kind of like those little watch batteries. Yep. So they're already installed. You don't have to do anything. Item number is 844001. Rebecca is staying with me throughout the entire hour. It's an entire hour of Thomas Kincaid items. But I do want to scooch over to hsn.com and show you a special that we're doing with Andrew Lessman as vitamins and supplements are all on free shipping and handling. He was the, he was here in studio a few days ago, and it was uh, it had his yesterday was his today special. So we still have some of the specials kind of uh, lingering today, which is wonderful. So stock up on your D3 and your nighttime formula and your hair, skin, and nails. I just named some of my favorites, but you know stock up because you've got free shipping and handling on everything. We're to continue on now with uh, Thomas Kincaid. This is, these are my favorites in the show and I showed them at the beginning because you're getting all three of them. No, you're not getting all three of them. You're getting, am I wrong? 
Set of three. You're getting a yeah, set of three. That's what I was Do you, you know, honestly, second guessing yourself. You're I'm like, no, you're getting three. Well, because <laughs> when I saw them on HSN.com, I saw them across the room. They look smaller, but in front of me, they're so big. I thought you can't possibly get all three for twenty-eight ninety-five. But there it is on my on my little card that is sometimes wrong. Uh, <laughs> it's the Christmas Chapel, Santa's Workshop, and the Christmas Light Express. Um, the you just pop in three AAA batteries three AAA and you're good batteries, to go. Three AAA batteries, and they do have the timer as well. Six hours on, 18 hours yeah. off, and it's a repeating timer, so you don't have to keep setting it. Um, they have this beautiful hanger as well, so if you wanted to hang it from any area, maybe you have it um, out, maybe you've got one of those little shepherd's hook, you can right. use a shepherd's hook, but they're gorgeous just to take it out of the box and sit it down. So what you're gonna notice here is again, it's the same three beautiful paintings. Here I have the Christmas chapel, but on each of the four panels, it's a different part of the painting. So as you turn it around, you're seeing the chapel, you're seeing um, the beautiful tree that's right there as well. And then we also have the sleigh ride. I'm gonna work it all the way down here to the sleigh ride. Do you see that? So each of the four panels has a different part of the Christmas chapel. Oh, I see. So the Christmas chapel is not just Christmas chapel, Christmas chapel, Christmas chapel. Right. It's, like, it's a different part so of the same is, painting. This is going to be kind the of Christmas focused chapel. on a different angle. You can see here we've got the sleigh ride, we've got the tree. Yes, so it's different angle of, of the painting. And these feel like a little more durable. They like, are. They're very, very durable. They're not going to be, um, you know, something that's going to break. Or you rust. Can, or, or rust. Exactly. It's very important. Um, but it is. And do you see the detail even in the panels? It looks like it is that uh, gorgeous stained glass and then it's lit from within as well it looks like a candle is mm -hmm. blowing is glowing inside there and it's a black frame like you it's a, these are rod iron lantern. it has like, the look of the iron rod look, iron yeah. exactly it has that look there's santa santa and then you can see there are where the elves are at work and then you do it all the way. My, this is my favorite part is actually the tree on that one because of the picture window mm -hmm. and it looks so cold out in the North Pole. Yeah. Uh, there's something to me that I always love looking at a painting, but I love to look beyond it. Does yeah. that make sense? And like, yeah, it does. what's happening it's, it's beyond that? It's got depth to it and there's more, it's like a real world inside the painting. Exactly. And that's what's uh, created. So what do we have in the last one? And then this is going to be Christmas Light Express. So you're seeing the very front of the train there and Santa kind of starting to swoop in. Here is Santa full view. And I'm telling you, when you look at this one close up, my favorite thing is to look at the expression on the reindeer <laughs> uh, because they lit, a couple of them are looking at the viewer of the painting like, you caught us, <laughs> you, you saw us. And then what you also can't see, which you're going to notice when you get this up close, he loved to bring deer into all of his paintings, especially the holidays. Mm -hmm. And he was able to do that here. There's a little cottage that's set apart and in, on, in the courtyard of the cottage, there are like three deer. And so that he did that because in the high Sierras where he was raised, right. there were deer everywhere. So he really took memories of where he was raised and, and inside his head and brought them to life. But somehow, me being from northern Minnesota, you're mm. from northern... Upstate New York. Upstate New York. Mm -hmm. You had deer as well, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Deer Everywhere. right in the backyard. See, that's what in we did. In the backyard. Yes, yes. exactly. <laughs> so I thought it was so funny that his memories are some memories that we have. They really are universal memories. Yes, yeah, absolutely. And again, you're getting all three of them for only $28.95. This is an entire hour of Thomas Kincaid items, which is so Americana. When you think about holiday, when holiday and art come together, it's always you're thinking about um, this incredible Thomas Kincaid. But again, uh, this is officially licensed. It's, this isn't like, oh, Thomas Kincaid-like or Thomas Kincaid-esque. This is the, you know, a state of Thomas Kincaid Kate is like approved from all his this studio from his studio from his actual studio so I just want everyone to know that there there is you know I think um, imitators and other things out there for this type of thing but this is the original you are getting an actual Thomas Kincaid you know creation of the set from the from the world of Thomas Kincaid and we are exclusively showing these to you you're not going to see these in any stores or any you know online anywhere else it's only here at HSN this 
collection that was curated with our HSN buyers, knowing what everybody at home likes, at home. right? And what our memories are. I mean, these, he was, as I said, I think it was the beginning of the 2000s, 82% of Americans had a Thomas Kincaid in their home. It was staggering. I know I do. Yeah, I do too. I grew up with yeah. it. And then I have some of my mother's. Um, she had yeah. plates. His beautiful plates would yeah. hang up for the holidays. And so we brought back those and his most popular. So you might even have mm. memories with one of these paintings. Right. And you might have bought them at HSN years ago, like I did. And we haven't had them for a long time. And when I saw that we were doing Thomas Kincaid, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so happy that this year Thomas Kincaid is back. And I know you guys are back in Christmas in July, but I, I wasn't there that day. Right. So I, I was like, this is the first time seeing it. And they're all beautiful and nostalgic. And I'm going to say something else. Everybody knows we're here in Florida, the st studios. And this is one thing that I really, really miss is that the holidays, the snow and oh, the lights yes. and the magic and the way the lights dance off the snow and it looks just like magical. When I feel like these pictures kind of bring that in. His paintings capture that yeah. to a T. And I do love the way that they're able to bring light into it because he was known as the painter of light. So in his, we didn't might not have had the actual light, but he was able to just capture the candles, the moon glow, the mm -hmm. snow glow. He was able to capture that. And then what we've done is added that light to even make it bigger and brighter and better than ever in such uh, unique ways. Mm -hmm. You're not going to find this right. everywhere. And, and this I will is tell you, unique. this is such a great gift for somebody who's like a new couple just starting out. Because I th every time like it's holiday time and I take down those big boxes and I open up each one and I remember, oh, I remember when I got this and I remember this and it you know makes me think of when my daughter was little you know Aww. and it's just it's just so like you just can't wait and that half of the fun is that moment of unboxing you, you do your own unboxing once a year oh my gosh and bring so out fun. those memories and these pieces will be something that either you or maybe you're gifting them to someone that they or will three unbox. people for three That's people because you get three are they separately boxed there's um they come together okay uh, but what one of the things that are so great about this is they're nine and a half inches so that's what I think is so important they when are you're looking at this and seeing this price. Mm -hmm. It is staggering that yeah. you're getting three, three of these. So this would be a perfect, you know, maybe mm -hmm. it's going to be a Christmas. Um, maybe it's going to be your teachers. I've got three daughters. We've got so many teachers we've got to give <laughs> to. It's not even funny. This is the perfect way to do that. And this is something that they're not going to get from four mm -hmm. other parents. No, and the, we're almost 300 have gone. And I know we only started out with a few a uh, hundred of everything. You know, this is a limited edition, limited collection. And when these sell out, this is what we have for 2023. Um, hopefully next year we'll get a new collection. I actually don't know. I didn't know last year that we would get a Thomas Kincaid collection this year, 2022. I didn't know if we were going to get this in 2023, but it is exclusive to us. So this is going to be something really special that you alone will have, that you'll open up, you know, year, you know, each time the season, you'll take out your Thomas Kincaid, just like I do, uh, my canvas that I have with the lights that you know, I mean, you will love, and I love these lanterns. I've never seen them before. And that speaks to um, the quality, too, that oh, you have yes. them for years True. and years Absolutely. and years and years. And you will, these just take batteries. I think it's, I have that right here. Three they AAA. Tri three tri AAA. Mm -hmm. They do have that repeating timer as well. So you're going to save on those batteries and you can hang them or set them down. They're beautiful mm -hmm. as is. And they all come to life with that glow inside. Over 300 have been ordered. 315, 16, 17. Well, check it out on HSN com if you want to get in on it but we're going to talk about the canvases which is um something that is near and dear to my heart oh my gosh i've been these are so beautiful i can't wait to show them to you so you have this beautiful canvas that you choose of the um the three that we've been talking about the art this is however a black friday deal and Black Friday deal means that it, we are guaranteeing that it's our best price of the of the season. Of, so you're not this season. You're not gonna. It's not gonna be like you're not gonna turn the TV on tomorrow and it's gonna be a different price, uh, lower. It might be higher, but it's not gonna be lower. You're not gonna see a lower price. 24 inch LED canvas prints, and these are these are beautiful and they're the ready to be canvas too, as you can see. So the sides are beautiful too. Yeah, they they are. They're they're. they're so it adds to the dimension. There exactly. You go. So they're very finished from all sides. It's not like you have to find a frame when this comes to you. Oh, this is a yeah. finished, finished look. Oh my gosh, these are beautiful. Aren't they beautiful? And so one of the things I'm going to show you as this is on, you can see that we've been very selective on where we were going to um, place those LED lights. Here we wanted to bring, and look at how different the LED lights are. So for the fire, 
We've created it so it will go up. So we've actually created that beautiful fire. It looks just like a roaring mm -hmm. fireplace. But then the lantern is more stationary. It's going to stay there, but it glows. By the way, the Santa's Workshop is the most limited. We only have 360 <sighs> left. People have already been uh, grabbing them buying. because of the Black Friday deal price. And then what I wanted to show you if, if, as we kind of go in, this is really going to be the best look at the detail. You could sit and stare at this for hours and still notice something new weeks down the road. Like it took me a little while to realize that back here, we've got all the reindeer ready to take off, <laughs> ready for Santa to come in. Yeah. But when you take a look at the tree, we've got micro LED lights inside that tree. So the tree actually illuminates, but then on top, we have the star, and that's a larger LED light. So there's different various sizes of the LED lights, different colors of the LED lights, making each of the items inside the painting come to life realistically. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at these, and they look like, for example, the roof here, I see it, they, they're almost like twinkling. Twinkly lights. Yeah. So Because you know what I love about the Christmas chapel? The Christmas chapel has, actually has so many icicles on it. And so when you have those micro LED lights, and those are going to be more of a bluish white light, it almost feels like those icicles are coming to life. But then you have the gorgeous candlelight from within the chapel, the light on top of the tree. And do you see, we do not have LED lights on the bulbs of the tree, but I, don't they, they look, look like, like they're, they're glowing. glowing? Yeah, I was gonna say, so you see the star at the top has is, is got the LED light, but this looks like it's glowing, the little amber lights through, throughout the tree, but they're, I don't, and, and, you know, you wonder, what, what are they doing inside? Are they, why are they up That's so late? What I, are, they I read, know. are they reading a book? What's happening? Here's another little tidbit. <laughs> yeah. With um, Thomas Kincaid, one of the things he loved to do, look at, you could almost see the people. Yeah. He did not paint people, but it's inferred that they're, that's, that, that's that the they're parishioners. Home. Exactly, yeah. that they're there um, worshiping and celebrating with their family and friends. But one of the things that Thomas Kincaid loved to do is to make um, a path or something that made your eyes follow and made your mind wonder, if I followed that little path, where would I go? So for this one, it's right outside the door where those, where those um, reindeer are waiting. Mm -hmm. You're like, what are the reindeer looking at as that door opens up? For here, you can actually see as you go past, when you take a look at it, there's a little pathway past the um, chapel, and then we have the river that follows it. So we always kind of create a little pathway, something that would wander off. So you're always wondering what's going on behind, beyond the painting. Mm -hmm. And I think that's what I love about him so much. He created such a realistic, beautiful picture mm. that you're wondering what are the people doing in the church? <laughs> yeah. What are the people doing in that cottage? Um, how cold is it? Is how cold? It in the sleigh where the reindeers are I up know. the top of the trees. How I mean, cold Santa's is that? beard has to have some icicles <laughs> of its own. Be I mean, it's it's gonna, <laughs> I'm cold just looking at it. I but love he, it. And one of the things that the studio did, so Lionel Train and Thomas Kincaid have worked together for, for decades. And Thomas Kincaid, when, when the studios put this together, the studios are actually the ones that painted this one. He trained the studio to paint in his Thomas Kincaid way, the Kincaidian way. Uh, so when they put this together, they really, when Lionel Train said, we want you to use this train set, it's one of their most popular train sets, they wanted to make it look realistic, so they actually scaled down the lights of the train. So if you had this Lionel Train set, which some of you out there might remember this particular set. You'd know that it was outlined in lights, but they also wanted to make it realistic in their paintings, mm -hmm. so they scaled the lights down. I like the light at the front of the train. It just casts a light all the way here, and the, the way it's smoke. painted here, it's sort of the rest of it. See, this is actually paint that, <gasps> that looks like a little amber paint that looks like the light is kind of shooting out the paint. Such a good point. You're right. Yeah, I, it's I, really see, amazing. That what I mean, like, I never really noticed that. So every person staring at these and looking at these and viewing these are going to notice something completely different. Well, it casts that amber hue on the All snow. All the way out. But it's, it's like the light's not on here, but that amber color is, it looks like it kind of, I mean, it's it just looks really like amazing. It's a light shooting ahead, yeah. just like it would with a train. There's a lot of motion. If you love motion and texture in a painting, mm -hmm. you are going to love the train picture. You're going to love this painting. If you love nostalgia. Right. The Santa's Workshop is the most popular. This one and is the most just limited. This one might be the last time time you see Santa's workshop. So if that's your favorite and you want this up in your house during the holidays, I would order it immediately by going to hsn.com and putting in the item number 786746 or open up the camera app on your cell phone and hold it over the QR code and then just 
tap it and it'll go to hsn.com and then you pick which one you want. If you want the Santa's Workshop, that's one that's gonna sell out first. You put it in your cart and then check out. Um, have you used the QR code to shop yet? Yes, and it's the easiest Isn't thing. Isn't it the easiest thing? I was like, wait, when it first came out? <laughs> yeah. Can it I show second, you something but real yeah. quickly? No, no, show so me. They have all, if you love Santa's Workshop, they have all the different toys in there. And I, there's one right here that I had as a kid. Do you remember really? That? Do you no, remember? No, let me see right what one it is. Do you remember the little um, Oh, I phone? do remember right that phone. Yes. <gasps> Look at that. I got that How? for Christmas when I was a little, little girl. I was like, you've got to be kidding me. That is, <laughs> I, see, it's like Easter eggs. Yes, the little yes, Easter, Easter eggs, eggs in, in, the, in the painting. So finding and discuff, discovering things. All right, Rebecca and I are going to take a teensy little break. And when we come back, we've got more Thomas Kincaid, including reversible holiday totes. What a great idea for a gift. So stay tuned. Tis the season to be a VIP. Use your HSN card to get the best deals on gifts for everyone. Shop now for the holidays and pay over time with ExtraFlex or VIP financing on every item and at least eight VIP savings events a year. Plus, the HSN card has no annual fee. Not a card member? Apply now and instantly get $20 off when you're approved. Visit hsn.com slash HSN card or call 1-800-695-1418 for details. It's HSN's biggest craft month ever. With exciting Craftober events full of hundreds of new arrivals, seasonal crafting, and offers we know you'll love. Shop hsn.com every Tuesday for new deals, specials, and more. HSN Craftober, Tuesday, October 24th, only on HSN and hsn.com. All right, well, we're continuing on with our Thomas Kincaid Hour. I'm Helen Keeney, along with Rebecca Wood, who is our expert, one of our home experts here at HSN. This is a woven reversible holiday tote. And, uh, you know, you think about how we decorate the house. And how I decorate myself is I holiday earrings, yes, right? Yes, you're right. We get out our holiday like jewelry. I've got sweater. holiday host pick is coming up on next Friday. I've got special holiday jewelry from Heidi Doss oh, that she did just for me. I'm excited about that. But this is a way that you can get ready for the holidays with a tote. I with think that's so fantastic. And it's reversible. And it's woven right into the fabric. So it's not painted on. So it's not something that's going to um, kind of chip away or crack. This is woven right into the fabric. Mm -hmm. It's a polyester can um, cotton blend, so very, very well made. When we say reversible, we mean that this is the same print on both sides, but at the end of the year, if you're like, oh, this is a great tote, you can, it's inside out. You can also have it as just plain black. Oh. Yes. So it's reversible and inside out. So you can use that as well. Oh, I see. So you could just turn it into like a black tote. Exactly. So and then have, have a black the print tote. part on the inside. 100%. Oh, very, very cool. All right, this is 14 and a half by 16 inch, and the handle drop is approximately 13 inches, which I want to mention that because, you know, when you're wearing your winter coat, if you don't have a substantial handle drop, it's hard to put your hand it's, through it. With those big, huge big, coats. Big, yes, puffy look coats. At that. But it's this, a great handle drop here. Yeah. You got a great, uh, you, so you know, got amount those of puffer coats. It's yeah. gonna fit right on there. Look at this. And again, it's the same three paintings. So you have there the Christmas chapel. Like, and this is pretty big. I mean, we've got like a little bit of stuffing in here, yeah. but this is this is a really nice size. Look at that. How pretty this is. Look yes. at I love that. I love that one. And I love that you can see the little sleigh ride there and the Christmas chapel. So it really does bring the painting to life while you're on the go. <laughs> I mean, that's amazing. Thomas Kincaid on the go. And the, this one, just want to say, mm -hmm. I, I guess I've always been gravitating towards Santa's workshop because it's mm -hmm. just fun. You look at it, it's happy and whimsical and fun. But look at how we've taken it and then we've muted it down mm -hmm. so it's not comical. So as yeah. you take it, we've got the more of the burgundy hues mm -hmm. now. We've brought it down to kind of a more er earthy tones. So the most popular is, guess? Santa's workshop. No. Nope. This one? Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. 
I love, it is beautiful. You really see that train going. To me, it's the most like snowy and kind of like, yeah. you know, if, you know, feels you like the, cocoa when I do, I do. I, that's, I do love the snow and I do miss that. You know, living in Florida, you do miss the seasons and I love having yes. that. I think it would be really fun. And honestly, you could wear, you could, you don't have to be like, oh, I, I, it has to be winter for me to wear it. You could wear that with a pair of jean shorts and a white t-shirt and have that fun bag. You'd get so many compliments. 100%. You and know? you're taking a piece of artwork with you to take right. to, I mean it, we really and remember it's woven into it it's not printed on it's not going to flake off it's not going to this is something you're going to be able to wipe down it's a polyester cotton blend very very this would well be made. a nice like a, a you know diaper bag like a nice like kind of like that or a book bag Br or bringing some gifts your gifts, wine bottles as you yeah go. it's a tote like a true tote bag you could bag. fit a lot of wine bottles in there <laughs> <laughs> Rebecca will tell you exactly how many being an expert on bringing how many wine bottles for <laughs> do you see we've taken the 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 the, I would say the focal point of each painting and we put it on each side so you can see it is reversible So it's the same one. You're not just getting that beauty on one side there, but then you've got Santa He's so big. He's just kind of whooshing in and then we have that beautiful Lionel train and what you're not seeing is the water There's a little river that runs by the cottage. We do have the cottage right there Let me see if you can see it see the cottage there and then there are the deer I was telling you he loves to work deer into it So all of the little intricate details is still mm. there in this woven tote All right, and you have again three choices and they, it is reversible So if you turn it inside out, it's a plain black tote that you can have any time of year, but then um, um, also great. And you know, when I think about teacher gifts, I know that this this would be a great, oh, you know, because yes, they're bringing so much My stuff mom and dad in. are both teachers and they're always like carrying books and the papers home to grade and things like that. So this would be like a wonderful a gift, but a gift for you. Treat treat yourself. $9.98 on FlexPay. Uh, if you would like to grab this, don't forget about that $20 coupon. If you, you get an HSN card today, you could take it off your purchase. So this tote would be $9.95. Here's how to get the HSN HSN card, go to hsn.com. Just put an HSN card in the search. It's super easy. But again, this is exclusive to us here at HSN. You're not going to see this tote anywhere else. It kind of looks like a museum gift shop type item. Oh, you that know? is such a great, yes. You know, because they have really like artwork and those special tote. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, but those are going to be like $70. It this is, is $29.95, so great Beautiful. deal. I want to remind you of the lanterns again. Very, very popular. Jared, how many uh, have been spoken for in our show? 500 have already been ordered. Almost half the quantity for the entire 2023 were ordered in our show. <laughs> so if you would like to grab them, we, we remember you're getting all three of them. All three of them. You're not choosing. You're getting all three. And it's only $28.95. What are the three scenes again on, on the uh, lanterns? So you're going to get the Christmas chapel. Okay. You're going to get... Um, My favorite. Um, Christmas Light <laughs> Express yes. and Santa's Workshop. Santa's Workshop. Thank Good you. job. All right. You always have me like, I'm looking at what you're up to next. I really am. I'm a good person. All She's right, a very good person. We're going to continue oh, no. on. And our, you know, our next item is really something I think unexpected. Uh, and that is a 100% soy wax candle. We have a lot of flameless candles, but if you love a candle, I'll tell you, my daughter absolutely is candle obsessed. I love candles. She lo she lo she she's not a flameless candle. She wants, I want the real thing. This is gonna last and last and last. 100 to 150 hours. 150 time. hours. And you see the Thomas Kincaid signature on the front and then the beautiful choices of the Christmas Chapel, the Christmas Light Express or Santa's Workshop. These are 6.6 .6 inches high by four inches in diameter. So, uh, and they have two, they're double wicked because they're yes, so big. Yes, they're so big. These are perfect for large rooms. So this is gonna be, if you have a great room, if you've got that large kitchen, living room combo, kitchenette combo, this is gonna be perfect for that. That's what I have. And one of the things I wanted to tell you is these smell the moment you open them up. They are beautifully, beautifully scented, and we'll walk you through the different scents that we have there. But do know you have 100 to 150 hour burn time with this, two wicks, and it's soy. So the best of the best, it is gonna be soy. As we walk through, I'm gonna tell you some of the scents that we have for each of this. So what am, I'm looking here at the Christmas uh, Light Express. This is gonna be spruce, and it's gonna be white pine. It's gonna be have base notes of cedar wood, so there's some warmth. This is one of those that's really, this is probably my favorite one, mm -hmm. the smell, for okay. scent. This is just 
I would say the holidays in yeah. a candle, 100%. You've got that pine, a little bit of the eucalyptus. It really, really smells really good. As we go to the white, that one is going to be um, the Christmas Chapel. This has white pine and the eucalyptus, warm cinnamon, fresh thyme, and cozy sandalwood. They gave these but notes and mid notes and base notes. So there's a lot of depth to the scent that we have here. This isn't just, so many times when you're looking at something like this, you think it's kind of a kitschy, oh, but it's for the art. This is a gorgeous scented candle as well with um, using the best of the best. And then here was Santa's workshop. This one's gonna be peppermint stick, vanilla sugar, and honey. And I had somebody, I was like, what does this smell like? And they're like, it smells like an Andy's chocolate, an Andy's mint. <laughs> oh yeah, those little sandwiches. It smells just, sandwich. yes, yeah. it smells just like that. All right, well, having shopped for a lot of candles, cause like I said, it's something my daughter loves. I could tell you they're like 50 to $100, this so size expensive. candles. Especially when you have a genuine 100% soy wax candle. Those are a higher end type of candle. They burn cleaner, as we say. Notice there's no like um, Smoker. kind of smoky. Those can kind be of actually like, headaches. Yeah, when yeah. you can see it, I do. I get headaches. Uh, yeah, and these are the these soy. burn really, really clean, and that's something that it makes them more expensive and more higher end. So the fact that you're getting this humongous candle for twenty six ninety five, this is a great gift. Um, we are doing our extended holiday returns. I should mention that anything that you buy now, you've got until January thirty first till twenty twenty four for exchanges, you know, for gift giving, because a lot of people are buying these gifts now and they're not going to give them for more than 30 right. days from now. So I want you to know we, we do have that in effect. Even though you're buying them now, you still have till the end of January of next year to return any of them. And I, I will give you a tip about a candle like this is you when you light it, you should let it burn for a while. You know, when you've got a big candle like this, let it burn instead for of a like while. turning it on and then, you know, blowing, blowing it out five right minutes away. later, let, let it, burn it go for, for like an hour or so. Yeah. Um, one of the things I did want to point out, too, you're seeing the two wicks here. I love that you're having two wicks because that's what it does make it perfect for a large room. The other thing is you move down, that's where the artwork's going to be. So you're getting that beautiful um, painting. It says from... Right on top, it says Thomas Kincaid Studios, and then the name of the actual painting is below it. So this says Christmas Light Express. And can you smell this? This yeah, is my smell favorite. This oh my gosh, I love that one. Oh, that does smell good. Oh my gosh, it smells like um, like you're in a evergreen. It, it, and, like and you're, the, you know when you shop for Christmas tree, trees? That's what I was going to say. It's like you're walking down the aisles. This is what lot. it smells like. Yeah, like the, like a different type, though, like a Bruce spruce. Because uh, we do you know, have the white, the pine, pine, white and the pine, spruce, like all the, the different. Fir. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, it smells. This one smells gorgeous. It smells so yeah. good. I want to. I want to. This is the one that's that is the, one the candy that they said one. Smell like Andy's mint. Oh yeah, it does. Ha that's exactly what it smells like. Yes. It has like a little bit of a mint. A and mint. what does the white one smell and like? And this one is going to be um, the white pine eucalyptus, warm cinnamon, fresh oh, thyme, and gosh. cozy cedar wood. You know, this reminds me of. Um, I had a a body wash, face wash, like uh, that was um, like a eucalyptus that reminded me of this. It's kind of like a spa almost. Wouldn't you say that this one's a more, a little bit more of a masculine scent as I well? Think, I, I think it is yes. a little bit more. So but if you do love it's those not musky. Like, it, it's not like white flower, florally feminine. That, exactly. That's not what it smells like. It's more of a musk, kind yeah. of a, a masculine, but beautiful, beautifully yeah, scented. Yeah, I like it. Like for, like for an office or a study or, I don't know, it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. I, you I really can't love go it. wrong. You will love, I love all that eucalyptus. Cents. That's one of my, that's something that you I got on yeah. my travels a year, hundred years ago. But um, again, eight, five, six, zero, three, four is the item number. I'd love for you to treat yourself. And how many hours does this burn again? You said hundred to 150 hours. This is substantial. This, this is, is going to get you all yeah. the way through the holiday season and then some, but remember, most importantly, you're getting that beautiful Thomas Kincaid artwork on the actual candle yeah. itself too. So that is something you could actually keep after as well. Do, do you, um, Put them out. Would you put your the lid on? Will it put? I would blow it out. Blow it out because okay. we do have the, the, okay. the rubber on the side. All right. So we're going to continue on. We've got our snowman coming up next. It is our final item. Is the 24 inch snowman. This is brand new. No one's ever seen it. I've got four flex for you. So under $15, $14.99, that 24 inch LED, it also has a lamp post. So it's an entire like scene. And uh, it runs on three AA batteries. You pop in and uh, it's a, you know, Thomas Kincaid, it looks like something that literally just sort of popped out of the painting and scooched over to our table. <laughs> if you are a Thomas Kincaid collector, 
you mm. will notice this right away and say, oh mm -hmm. my goodness, yeah. that is from uh, A Night Before Christmas, his most popular Christmas painting to date. We've taken that wonderful, fantastical, whimsical snowman and brought him to life. So if you are somebody who collects it, you're going to notice right There's away. There's kind of like a look on his face, like He's the a, cat who ate the canary. It's you. <laughs> <laughs> what? I have no idea what she's that talking about. You. I have the look of innocence on my face this at all is times. Helen Key, if she were a snowman. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it is substantial, though. It is very large. You can see that it glows from above. You've got that beautiful lantern that glows from above but it is beautiful, and again, it's something that doesn't scream um, Thomas Kincaid artwork. We've taken right. a piece from his most popular painting, A Night Before Christmas, and we've brought it to life. You know, this one, again, is really for, you know, all denominations. It's all, just, yes. you know, it's a holiday, you know, snowman. I, when I think of a snowman, I think of snow days. Did you have snow days growing up? Oh, my gosh, you'd watch it. And you'd watch the weather. The crawl you like, on yeah, the yeah, bottom, yeah. and you'd be, like, and be like, please, yay. Willow River, Willow River, Willow River. <laughs> <laughs> right, like, was, was my school district school included in this? You know, <laughs> you would get to have the day off of school if it snowed a lot. I know not everybody in the country has experienced that, but where, where I grew up, there a snow day. And then me and my brother and sister would go outside and build a snowman and oh, you know, so much fun. kind of raid the refrigerator for my mom's like and, and, and put the you know the eyes and, and the, the nose. Eyes, like the, there's the a carrot carrots. and the nose and Fine. and then yeah. my mom would be like, Where's my red scarf? Oops. <laughs> <laughs> where's, where's my hat? And it would be mom's hat on top of the snowman. Oh, I miss that. I mean we really do. This just brings back memories, like you said, of winter. Yeah. Just winter. the magic mm -hmm. of winter. And I think if you've ever grown up, if you were somebody that has ever even experienced cold weather. I know my, um, we don't have winter down here. My daughter was born in Florida, but we went up to North Carolina. And what was the first thing that we did when we went up there to a mountain? We made a snowman. That was yes. the first thing she said, please. And it was only this big. It was oh. about that size, but we did it. <laughs> yeah, I, I mean, and again, this is exclusive to us here at HSN. This is home decor. And you know, if you've got like a, I know this is definitely indoor, but if you've got like a covered patio and you've, do, you know, doing a Pop, a holiday party you could have it on your front stoop for a while I mean it's just real it's because it's substantial it's not like a teeny little itsy bitsy no. it's, it's pretty big this is going to be perfect for yeah. maybe right by your front door or I have stairs window. going even up even if you've got a like a window. bay window it'll it'll look really kind of that cute. would be beautiful that yeah. light sets it apart so you can see it and I love light especially when we talk about it just last night I was like oh my gosh it is 6 30 and it's getting dark already so that's why it's so important to bring light into your home somehow right so how beautiful is this um, piece of decor mm -hmm. that's substantial and then at night it just turns magical. Uh, absolutely magical. And, and this is, I mean, the 24 inches high. This is quite, quite it's big. Large. This is substantial. It's not like a little, I wouldn't even say, oh, this will be on your dining room table. No, I think it's kind of too big for that. I think it's, like, as I was saying, I have stairs going up, and I think right at the foot of the stairs yeah, or by cute. the base That's of the door. Idea. If you have a mantle, if you do have oh, a mantle, yeah, it would be that beautiful would be great. by the that mantle. That would be great. Um, sometimes you have a faux mantle even inside. If or you had even a, next to the Christmas tree. Oh, that'd be beautiful. You yeah. Know, because it's like it, it sort of creates this whole you know kind of scape of, of holiday but I love the idea of in a window so the neighbors walk by and see the little kind of wink smirk of that little snowman I was just that's gonna snowman. bring it up. I just just told somebody a joke I'm telling you that right now I've got a look couple at good snowman it's jokes half a too. smile right there <laughs> he's very proud of the joke he just told this is what I'm getting and do you see how his little hands they're kind of you can moldable you can move them if you want them up high if you want them just like this. so I always made mine going up so I thought it was funny that whoever put this out here had theirs going down. <laughs> because I always, mine always were like that. So I love that it's a little bit moldable that you have there. You've got the top hat that has that heavy snow on top of it. Mm -hmm. So, and then you've got the wreath, the beautiful, beautiful wreath on that classic lamppost. And by the way, it, what makes this look like real snow in a snowman to me is it's not like a white, perfect ball. It, it's got right. a little bit of, you know when you make a snowman, right. it's like a little different colors and it's a little dirt and it's a little, you know, you're making it some, Mud. It's not like a, you know, oh, somebody spray painted this white. It looks really like it snow. It looks like a real yeah. snowman that you've kind of rolled mm -hmm. the snow on the, the ground and made it. And again, it's from A Night Before Christmas. It is one of Thomas Kincaid's most famous works Iconic. of art. Yeah. Iconic. That is a perfect descriptive oh, word for it. It is. And we've taken this right from 
uh, a night before Christmas, and then we've taken it apart and made it. So it's a standalone. It's beautiful. Yeah, and this definitely is that sort of door greeter look. Like when yeah. you open the door and it's he's sort of like, hello, welcome to my home. Here's my little wreath and my, Here's my the lamp little wreath. And I, you know, it's like a nice way, like when you come in the house to kind of be greeted. Yes. You know, there's all sorts of little art that people have at their front door that greet people. But this is like, would be perfect to do that. And it's sort of like, we're going to have fun at the holidays. Come on in. It'd be great. You know, if you're having a party or just every time, you know, when the kids come home from school, they see that. They it see makes them, smile. It makes exactly. them smile. Yeah. It takes uh, three AA. That's it. Three AA batteries. Mm -hmm. yep. uh, and it's very simple. You just put them on here on the bat on the bottom here. Um, and that's it. It's it's all you is have it to on do. a timer or is it on off? Yes. I'm going to show you here as I bring it up. There's a little timer there. We have a six hour timer. So oh, okay. We okay. always do that so repeating that, timer. Oh, I like that because yeah. then at the same time every day it'll pop on and then you don't it have to turn think off. About it. You don't have to think about it like, oh, did I turn off the snowman? Well, no. that or I always just forget. So I'll go a week and I'll be like, oh, I never turned it on again. So I love <laughs> right, right. that it's That's just more set. like it. Yeah. And then you come home at night when it is getting dark earlier now and you've got that light illuminated. Maybe you've picked up a few different pieces and you're going to spread mm. them throughout your house and you've got that light illuminating. Right. And you didn't have to go and turn them on. They did it automatically. Yeah. And again, this is going to be something that you're going to love to unbox every year. Oh, yeah. And, and you could Name for them. sure leave it, leave it out, you know, through the winter. This oh, is, you yes. know. It yeah. doesn't scream any holiday. It, it, right. It really exactly. Is more of a it's just yeah. like sort of fun and whimsical. What would you name him? Mm, Jared. Jared. <laughs> Jared's a snowman. Pastor, Jared. <laughs> Jared's a perfect name for the snowman. Jared. Yeah. Jared does make that face. Yeah, a he lot. does. See, I see that. That's our producer. That's his face. Uh, that, He's that, doing that right now. That's I actually think. his headshot that he has. It's his headshot. I think we're going to put it on the wall of the hallway. <laughs> and then Jared. We the should do that. <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. Thank uh, you. My name is Helen Keating, and this is my two hour show. We are continuing the magic of the holidays here live in the studio with my good friend Debbie D, who's going to be coming up next with more wonderful uh, holiday magic, magical items. Um, Debbie, what do you have coming up? What do you got next? Is it more